Hello everyone, this is me, Satya here, and I'm back with the second week of September Read stuff on this 8th through the 14th of September 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. So Pisces, let's see what's coming in for you for this week time. Um, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it's a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services, including palm readings that I offer now. So, let's see what's coming in for Pisces for this week time. Let's begin. The Justice. The Artist. The Devil. Six of Wands. The Empress and Knight of Wands. I think the deck we do have for of uh, Wands. Now, for majority of you, my Pisces, you are definitely having the greatest power to create the life that you want to create for yourself. I really feel like, in for majority of you, Divine is going to be supporting you in every move that you make towards what you truly desire. So first of all, you have to know what is it that you truly wish to create for yourself. What is it that you want to manifest? What is it that you want to achieve in your life? Writing down the goals, writing down the wishes is going to make things easier for you to achieve. Um, as you will be seeking guidance to get closer to what you are asking for. I really feel like you know there will be divine help with you all this week time to manifest, to create the life that you want. And you are going to have a lot of passion towards it as well. So whether it's a relationship situation, whether it's a, a work life situation, whether it's a home life situation, whether you want to purchase, sell something, you want to get a job, you want to earn money, you want to have a commitment coming in, you want to meet somebody new, whatever your goal is, whatever your wish is, make sure that you write it down in particular detail around it. And you are going to get through all the you know obstacles that you're going to be dealing with or that you might be dealing with for some of you already. And you are going to come out successful with, with uh, your goals that you are having right now. Because there is something in this big time energy where Things going to happen quicker than you know it. So make sure that you are aware of that and you make the most of this time. I really feel like, you know, for the majority of you, you are going to be pursuing your dreams, goals, desires diligently and dedicatedly during this week time. I really feel like, you know, for the majority of you, you're not taking any physical action. In fact, you are manifesting it by taking mental actions and by changing something from within to go to get what you want for majority of you 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 will be having the support of the people as well to get to what you want to go for so um i really feel like you know for some of you um this week is going to be bringing you a lot of success and luck in your life to be honest and i feel like you know there will be a lot of attention that you would be getting from around you um, for majority of you, you are ready and prepared to receive the rewards. You are ready and prepared to have what you want. But yes, the only obstacle that I see here for you is indecisiveness. For majority of you, you are some, some sort of indecisive. Even if it's a job, even if it's something that you want to buy or sell, even if it's some decision that you have made, you are still unsure of it. Uh, even if it's a new love life situation that you want to dive into and then you are still stuck on pause. Even if it's uh, you want to move on or you want to stick around. Even if it's like, uh, do you want to even get into a relationship? So there is some sort of indecisiveness, which is the reason why you're not getting through this time. So that's why I'm saying make a major decision, which is very important that you are going to make during this week time. So you could see yourself moving forward towards what you truly desire. I really feel like, you know, once you have, have that clarity and understanding and decisiveness, around what is it that you truly wish to have in your life, you will be able to create it quicker than you know it. I really feel like you know there will be divine support with you. No matter whatever happens, you will get through this time and you will get what you want. So I really feel like you know this week is the time when you are going to be um, setting some new goals for yourself, be that in love, work or home life, and you will be getting your success out of that as well within this very big time which is really beautiful energy to have to be honest and i really feel like you know you are going to be very passionate as well towards achieving your goals so you are going to be giving your 100 percent to it um for majority of you uh 
it is going to start from within. Like I said earlier, you're not going to be taking any physical action towards anyone, uh, towards anything. You will have to change something from within. And when you take mental action, that's when you start heading forward with a lot of progress around it. So that's what I see coming in. Let's see some cards to see what is coming in for you in your love life in particular. Let's see what's coming in for you in your love life in particular. I feel like it's more about you ready to not um, settle in for less for sure. Because uh, that's what we see here with the Empress energy here. That's where the success comes in. When you know your worth, when you know your value, when you stand up for your beliefs, that's when you start getting the appreciation that you're getting. And I feel like, you know, you're going to be on the right path to achieve the goals that you want to achieve. Uh, but again, uh, there is something which you are indecisive about still. You have to make a clear decision about that. Let's see what's coming in for you in your love life. I mean, if you like, you know, for majority of you, you're choosing you right now. You're choosing to work on yourself right now for majority of you. And I feel like, you know, if you have been stuck in love life, uh, whether you're single, whether you're in a situation trip with someone, um, things might have been very stuck and stagnant for you. And I feel like you know, you're not letting that control you now. For majority of you, you're going to bring your focus back to yourself. You're going to do the things that are best for you right now. Bringing your focus to yourself, loving yourself, uh, giving time to yourself, your business, your career, and um, feeling more good about yourself. That's what you're work is all about and that's when you attract or start attracting all the things that you want when you're feeling good about yourself i feel like you know, you're gonna feel very happy excited and fulfilled during this week time i really feel like for majority of you um there might be an offer coming your way um or your relationship that you are having with a specific someone might be getting uh, going to the next level because I really feel like you know it's it's going to be a time of your life where you are going to be the top priority during this week time I really don't see another person's energy here but I really see you very happy and fulfilled so even if you are dealing with someone I really feel like you know your relationship with that person is going to be probably the least important to you because you would be focused more on your happiness on your um uh, dreams, your goals, than than your your specific someone or than your love life. So I really feel like you're more uh, working towards yourself and uh, you're more loving yourself than anything else. For some of you, you could be de dealing with the same sex situation as well. And I feel like you know there is a lot of um, there's a lot of uh, good time that you're gonna be spending with uh, probably with the people that you love and you receive love from. Uh, it can be a family as well, but I really don't see a specific someone getting too much atten attention and love from you during this week time. I do see you very focused on yourself and attaining your goals, attaining your um, you know, perfect way of living is what I'm picking up. So I really feel like there's not going to be much happening in your love life, but I really see you very happy and fulfilled. So even if you are single, you're not going to be concerned. Even if you are like in a in a situation trip with someone and you want your love life to move forward, you're not going to be concerned about it at all. So I really see that you are going to be with that mindset where you feel like you're good enough for yourself. So that is going to be your attitude for this uh, week time. Uh, where where you're going to be like moving forward with positivity and more focus on yourself. I really feel like, you know, for some of you, you might be missing someone in love, but at the same time, you are going to be calling in that soulmate in your life. You're not going to be chasing after someone. So it's more about you working on yourself. So you attract more love into your life by focusing on yourself, by loving yourself more. So I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, probably either you are single or you are dealing with situations where probably there is something off between you and your specific someone. Because I really don't see you more into another person. I really see you more into you right now. And there is something or someone out there that you would, you're you going to be thinking of or missing. But um, you are going to be calling in that person. You're not going to be like chasing after someone. So your focus is going to be pretty much on you during this week time. Let's see some guidance for you. Um, but before we dive into that, let's take some cards from this deck. Hold on. Let's see what else is coming in for you. What else is coming in for you?
I really feel like, you know, your prime focus is going to be money, monetary gains, financial stability, and your your lifestyle is what I'm picking up. I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, this is going to be a good week overall for you to attract more abundance in your life. So you might be making good amount of money during this week time. Maybe there will be success coming up for you in your business or work life. There will be a lot of uh, appreciation that you're going to be getting and you would be passionately working towards your career goals as well. So um, we'll see what is the guidance for you during this week time. Shed the old skin. The divine really wants you to shed the old skin and try to embrace the new version of you, which is more focused on yourself, which is more focused on loving yourself and valuing yourself, which is more focused on um, getting um, your life together without uh, depending on another person. So I really feel like, you know, you are going to be experiencing a big change in yourself during this week time where you're... Uh, doing good for yourself without a person in there uh, in, in your life uh, and I really feel like that's going to be a big change for my for my fishies because maybe you are so habitual of uh, um, depending on others for your happiness and for your fulfillment but this week is the time when you're going to be more focused on yourself and reliant self-reliant uh, be open to healing information I feel like you know the divine is going to be bringing you a lot of uh, uh, positive energy and there comes uh, some sort of information too which is also going to help you ease around um, something in your life I feel like you know, for some of you maybe you're going to get to know that you know the person that you were wanting or missing or something like that maybe that person is also missing you too maybe you're going to realize that you know a specific someone that uh, um, that that uh, you uh, you want to you you are you wanted to be a part of uh, you know that person's life Maybe they are still single and they are wishing to get back with you or something like that. So there will be some sort of information coming around this person that you're dealing with, uh, which is going to come through, which is going to ease your uh, the only part which, which you might still be struggling, which is love. Um, even though I don't see that to be the focus, but because there is not much happening in your love life, probably you are still having that. Uh, you're trying to kind of... Um, mask your feelings up around your love life and try not to kind of think more about it but yes there will be some information coming in for you during this week time which is going to heal your heart which is going to make you feel good which is going to make you feel positive so probably you are going to manifest the soulmate during this week time uh by not you're not going to manifest that person in this week time it's more like you're manifesting that energy where you are in perfect alignment to receive uh, what you truly desire in love, uh, the happy energy, the the mutual energy, the love that you truly seek and desire. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week time. If it was of help, do like, share and subscribe. And uh, yeah, until I do the next read for you guys, take care. Bye.